In family medicine, we're developing and evaluating new interventions that address social factors that improve health or the social determinants of health. We're doing some work that nobody else is doing around the world, as we found at a recent international meeting in London. We're at the forefront of this area. A lot of social issues, things related to income, people's jobs, housing, are actually at their root legal issues as well. And legal problems are incredibly common. A recent national study of Canadians found that over half have experienced a legal problem that was serious and difficult in the last three years. And about two-thirds of people don't know their rights and don't know how to access legal services and report fear of the legal system, both the process and the costs. These problems cause stress, emotional difficulty, and problems with people's health. In my own practice, I've had patients who have experienced eviction without cause, uh, being deported from the country because they couldn't manage the legal uh, status system here, being denied their rights, and being denied wages. In each of these cases, having timely access to a lawyer would have been invaluable and prevented much hardship. We've been fortunate to receive a grant from Legal Aid Ontario to fund a lawyer on site for, as an advocate for our patients. This is the very first legal program that's embedded in a family health team in Canada. And it has the potential to really change how we work with our legal colleagues and the makeup of primary care in this country. Here's a few quotes from patients who have experienced this program and also talked about it. Eric mentioning that this is an incredibly good idea and it's nothing but help. Nigel, who's talking about a, a, a housemate of his who was having problems, he said that you know because of his mental state, he didn't go to the tenant board. He figured he couldn't get help uh, from them. In the end, he got evicted, and he just didn't have the ability to get a lawyer. Or Gary, who's mentioned that you know when I have a doctor's appointment, if I'm able to see a lawyer, that would be incredibly convenient, and also I would trust this person. I'd have confidence in them because they were actually part of the health team. So we're really excited by this project, but also not only helping individuals, but looking at the big picture. We know that if we can address problems that are happening in communities, when we look across cases, this could be very powerful. In the US, one example of a medical legal partnership found a cluster of cases of children with asthma and notice they are all in the same building and the lawyer stepped up and was able to push the municipality to actually make changes for that landlord and it's actually led to a reduction in ER visits uh, with kids with asthma. We're excited to, with this project to use a novel design called a stepped wedge design that takes advantage of how we're going to roll this out across our six clinic sites. By bringing lawyers and physicians together, we can have an incredible impact on some of the key factors that determine health. Thank you. Thank you.